Hello everyone, it's Jonathan here, and I'm here to tell you that the new CDL road test is coming faster than expected. That's right. We've been telling you in previous videos that the road, new CDL road test is changing in sometime in August, but it's actually changing in July. That's crazy, right? And if you don't even know what I'm talking about, in order to get a CDL license, you have to go through a two and a half hour long road test as part of that process. Now the road test has been the same for a pretty long time, and the, for whatever reason, this year they're deciding to change it. We've been told that August was the actual change date. And what we've actually found out was in some states like New Jersey, they're actually changing it in July. That's right. I think it's like July 17th or so is when they're actually making the change happen in the state of New Jersey, which is scary for a whole lot of students who've been getting ready to make sure that they can be ready for August, but they're actually going to have to get ready for July itself. Now, the cool thing about coming to a school like ours here at Driving Academy is we have our own third-party testing site, which means if you don't want to take the new test in July, which means it's going to be a lot harder to pass the test, and you probably don't have the proper training for it, maybe, just maybe, you can go to a third-party testing school who does testing outside of the state of New Jersey like we do, wink, wink, and then in that case, you can actually wait till July 28th, and that's when the actual test will switch over in the testing facility facility that we're testing in itself. And that's kind of a cool loop around for all those people who want to buy themselves more time because maybe you've been studying the pre-trip inspection for a while, maybe you've been practicing the parking maneuvers for a while, maybe you actually failed the test once or two times and you want to make sure that you actually get a uh, try at the old test before you have to be forced to switch over to the new test. Now this can only be done at third-party testing sites, right? So here at Driving Academy in our Linden location, we do have access to our third-party testing site and you're able to go through that testing site uh, in, the, in the meantime and you don't have to worry about the new test happening in July. Now if you haven't heard about the new test yet, one thing that you do have to understand is any time a test does change, it usually does not change to make it easier. It usually makes it a little bit more difficult. So these are the changes that are going to be happening. We don't know all the details, but this is what we do know. So the road test itself has been to three different parts. Part number one is going to be inspecting the truck. They're going to have to know how to inspect both the inside and outside of the vehicle. That is going to be changing a little bit. The script's going to be changing. They're going to be uh, reducing the amount of items that you're going to have to say, but they're going to give you more details per items to actually talk about, which means more each item is going to be worth more, which means if you make less mistakes, you have the potential of still failing the test very easy. The next portion of the test is going to be parking skills. Traditionally, there was up to six different parking maneuvers. You're going to have a straight line backing, you're going to have an offset to the right, offset to the left, parallel park to the driver's side, parallel park to the passenger side, and then alley docking. Out of those six, they're going to test you on three of them. Definitely a straight line back, definitely one of the offsets, and either going to be a parallel or an alley dock. Now it's completely different. Now the first maneuver is going to be a pull up, front up, or stop. Then it's going to be followed by a straight line backing. From there, it's going to be followed by a right turn. And then it's going to be followed by like an offset parallel mix, right? So those are going to be the four main maneuvers that you're going to be tested on, which can make it more difficult if you've been training on the old way this whole time, right? The other thing that's going to be happening is the road test. That's the third portion of the test, and that's the only portion that's not going to change, right? So they're talking about a whole lot of changes in the first two portions, and if you don't pass one of those first two portions, it doesn't matter how good you are driving on the road, because you won't even get the chance to go on the road itself. So if you do not want to go along with the new road test change in the state of New Jersey, and you want to wait a little bit longer before you're forced to go to that, I invite you to come on into Driving Academy, check out our website. We have a limited road test available before the actual test does change in July because we are pretty booked out but if you do want to take advantage of that make sure you go to our website or give our team a call 908-525-3609 because the road test is changing in just a few short days here in New Jersey and if you want to try to extend it and buy yourself some more time come on over we can definitely help you out give our team a call we'll guide you through the whole process 908-525-3609 and then we will start training you for that old test and make sure that we transition you to the new test if we have to, if you don't give us a call in time because we might be already booked out. Thank you and I'll see you soon. Hey, thank you so much for watching this video. If you like it, make sure you hit that like button. Also, subscribe to our channel. It's really gonna help us out. Click on that button. And if you wanna continue yourself on your road to freedom, here's more videos to watch. There's endless amounts. Hopefully we get to see each other one day very soon. Thanks.